All right, let's go the way of which Destiny has told us to go up the ladder, which will probably lead into the church. That's just a guess, though. I could be very off the mark. Open the hatch. It certainly looks like the church. Yeah, the doors were just concrete. That's the only way into it, it seems. Well, it certainly looks kind of like a church. Is that Deuce's hat, or is that like a spike? Huh. Let's go look up here. I'm not gonna press any of those buttons yet. I'm not gonna turn that lever yet either. Same with candle holder. I wonder who lit the candles. Read note. Our writing, it sucks for now, says Roger. There will be better. More to learn. Stories. This looks useful. We note. Observing, we know. Soundings, humans making art. Instrument for data. Beauty and his cries of all. Yes, puncture for science. Music men for... He met a man, an eyeless man, a toothless man, and he looked at the man, the man looked at him. And he saw the man was beloved and dearest of friends, and the man spoke to him, How long since you have tasted some bone marrow? And he told him, he told him truthfully, and the man said, Come, and he went with. The man, and they vomited pure, cold, clean water into the endless, eternal, infinite sea. And then, the end. A story by We the Four the One. Black. It's like an alien wrote it or something. Meet we the four, the one we have language, writing too, and power to put it in. We are gods now, if ever we weren't. Gods need domains, unfractured domains. So we make another, a better one. A terrium, maybe they call it, ask Roger. We call it kingdom. The greatest experiment yet. Four humans go in and live. We're writing a tome, a silver of wisdom, a sliver of wisdom. It will keep the father's beast away. A glowing sky ball will be our throne. A moon, maybe they call it, ask Roger this too. And the sky ball will be wisdom too. Kingdom will be kept alive. That name seems familiar. Roger, the article said name, someone named Roger Cox owns this place. And he's a reclusive, right? You said you didn't read it. I may have read a bit. Candle holder. Where with the candles? Yeah, yeah. It's just illegible scribbles. Guess we have some notes. There's our map. Here's this. 010111. The farm of pigs and smoke. Now, the bridge is a simple puzzle. It's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Yep. So this is zero, so I don't click it. This is one. That's zero. One. An organ. I guess that's a music machine. Now let's turn the lever. Oh. Well, that made an orb appear right above the spike thing. I guess we're gonna touch it. What? That felt really weird. What the hell just happened? Jeez, it's hot. And it smells like rotten meat. And I feel floaty. Where are we? I have no idea. way that we came. Same pole. Looks like a telephone pole. Except without wires. Finishing each other's sentences. Can I walk off the side of the earth? No, I didn't think so. Well into the city then. Yeah, I'm gonna run there. It'd be too slow to walk there. Let's see what's deeper into the crevices. I like the building look. Let's try and examine a few of the buildings to see what we see inside. Some buildings. 
They look like skyscrapers. They aren't, though. There's a big black building over there, which means, look, I'm not going to comment on the fact of this soulless moon. It doesn't look like any of these have anything in them. There are light posts, though. It doesn't seem to be emitting any light. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything inside any of these buildings, at least looking at a distance. There's a noise coming from that that's just not me. Because I'm in smaller buildings. I have no idea what these are. Skyscrapers. Baby skyscrapers. Well, that's one way to think about it. Tower. It's like a clock. It's like a clock thing. On the side? No. Well, I guess that's just the noise it's making like a tick tock. That sounds kind of like a drum. Alright. There are things to note definitely over here. Some farmhouse are approaching as well. Get to the top of this first. Let's go take a look. It's like a glowing circle there. For some reason, they're not commenting on them, despite them being bizarre. Pick up. Can I throw at one of them? There you go, it's for all of them. Do I, is there fall damage? No? Okay. Didn't think there would be, but good to check. Actually, someone scared me right then. It's the bell, though. It's from the clock thing. Oh, it's, it's kicking in a little bit stronger. The moon thing's getting closer. Next up is the farm place, actually first up here. Anything up on these parts? Pick up, throw. Pick up, throw. Pick up a hammer, throw it at the can. That did not quite work as I would have hoped. Farmland, you're next. Then over there. That's making noise. Maybe I, I don't know if that's what I should investigate first or this over here. Jeez, I don't know where we're supposed to be going. I'd like to investigate everything because it's, it's something alright. Well, I'll look over here because I'm here, I guess. It's a lot of hooks. Do you think these are what you're looking for? They're sharp and pokey. No, I don't think. Ages. <sighs> What's wrong? You smell awful. Like near covered in <sighs> horseradish. Radish. I would recommend not sniffing them then. I would recommend not sniffing them, okay. Uh, let's dance somewhere else, please. Some structures. They look like silos. Or dildos. Good lord, Haley. Come on, I'm 13 years old. You do know I've reached puberty, right? I am not going to have this conversation with you. Uh, over there, there. The entrance to the gate area is over here. I am to explore and magic. Entrance is yeah, here. Snow pipe. I thought you smoked. <laughs> yeah, well, this stuff is <laughs> poison. 
and cigarettes aren't <laughs> examined well. What's in there? I don't know. Looks like a mess of concrete. It's really not making a noise in there. There it is. What are they? Just big blocks of concrete? I think so. So, what exactly are we doing? Looking around. That's what I'm doing. The fence is made of iron, but it's covered in tiny scratches that look like wood grain. Wow, these are big. Wretches, what's wrong? Okay, it's the cover again. The cages, so... Uh... Tower. What do you think this is? I don't know. Guess. I don't know. You have no imagination. I know. This door seems suspicious. Sand and windmill. I don't feel a breeze. I wonder what's making the blades turn. Spirits. I don't know. Looks like it's part of the ground. What, is this a doghouse? No, there's no door. It's made of concrete, like everything else here. It's the size of a shed. And I don't hear anything barking inside. Well, it looks like a doghouse. Looks like a concrete shed. Looks like it's made from a single piece of iron. Examine the sun. Well, that's the most unsettling sun I've ever seen. Looks like part of the ground. All right, well, I'm gonna come back to this building. Or I'll investigate to see if the door's open or if I need a key, and then if it does open, I'll go back. Oh, door just opened like nothing. I haven't seen, I haven't seen anything these would go to. They don't look like they're doing anything of use, except making a cool clicking noise. She's got a point. Examine nails. Just some nails. You sink. This one actually works. Ah, it's adorable. Pick up and throw gears into the plan. They look like they're made of aluminum. Pick up. Examine tools. Yuck. What? Something about this. These are really disgusting. They're just tools. Yeah, but they look like they're some sort of tools to torture someone with. Is there a... I don't know why I have a shiny rock with me. It seems important. But to be fair, I don't actually know if it's important. I just think that it is. I'll leave it right here in case it turns out actually being important. Now let's look back here. Salmon knives. Just some ordinary kitchen knives. Is this blood? Is that blood? I think so. Good lord. Pigs? I... Examine saw. Oh, yeah, stop looking at it. It's making me feel sick. Examine saw. Examine object. Looks nasty and... Sh looks nasty and sharp. Indeed. Looks like it's made from a single piece of iron. No, I'm not going to touch that. That's the way out of here. Which means time to investigate. Over here before you go take our route out. Just going to first see what's over here. Then we'll be good. Thankfully, you can run pretty fast in this game. Over here we have whatever this is. Examine debris. Oh wow! What the hell? 
It's like a house that's been deconstructed and lifted into the air. It's in fireplace. That's weird. What? It's ice cold. Pick up book and throw it. There's no hinge, they're just solid iron. It looks like a bed. I suppose, but it's made out of concrete. A lot of things definitely see around here. I'm not gonna pick up the cups in here. Here's a paper. What does this one say? Zero one one zero one zero. The Thorn Forest. One zero one 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 zero. The Void. One one zero zero one zero. The Music Machine. So basically, those are different things we can put back inside the machine. Some heavy iron stakes. This note also means that it's possible for us to use the machine to go to different areas. Obviously, the music machine is where we want to go, but yeah. I, uh, let's see what these are. Examine thing. This one isn't making any noise. Oh, this one isn't making any noise. Examine things. Are they breathing? I don't know. Examine pile. Looks like billions of tiny needles. Want to go for a dive? Or want to go for a dive? No. See what's over here by this tree, then. And then I think we have what we need to get out of here. Tree. Part of the ground. I think we've done what we need to do. We got the note and we got this. I'm also going to pick up the rock because the rock strikes is a bit odd. So I'm going to see if I can take the rock with me. Running on through to pick up the rock, then get the X, and now that we have a note that can show us how to reach different areas. So I guess this is one of the areas the organ can take us, not the only area. Alright, I got the smoking rock. I don't know if this actually goes anywhere, but I'm gonna go this way. Eh. That wasn't it? Okay. Just a guess. Listen, yep, it'll take us back to the church. We can use the machine to take us to different areas. That one gave us the note that we needed to go to different worlds. The music machine, obviously, is going to be the final area because it has the name of the game. So let's go to the Thorn Forest. It's 011. So 011010. Let's try the Thorn Forest. Ow! Ow, Quentin! The rain! What? Get inside! Hurry! Ow! I think it's actually a death mechanic in this. So what's your problem? The rain. It's hurting me. Is it acidic? No, it's... I don't know. I can't explain it. Alright then, back out we go. No! I can feel it killing me. Don't go back out there. You remember what I'm trying to kill you, right? Yeah, whatever. Don't go back out there. <sighs> we can't stay here forever. Okay, fine. Just try to stay inside when you can. The pain's going away now that we're not outside. Quentin, seriously, it hurts. There's a big old building over there. Let's make a book for it. There's a shed over there which I'm gonna go investigate. in the spot, not that I can tell. I guess we're gonna head towards that big building. I just wanna see if there's anything in there. Alright, rain, rain, go away. Stop seeing us with needles for another day. That's a big iron pipe. Ow. 
Wow, this feels awful, Quentin. Bring me inside and let me have a break. Does, does it count as inside? Please, Quentin, please. It hurts. I'm dying. That killed me. I was trying to see what the death thing's like. I can't say that's what I saw coming. Let's explore here for a bit. Now I could obviously go to the two towers over there. Three towers, correction, actually there's more. Looks like there's four. Who's there? Haley? No. Who are you? It doesn't matter. All right, I suppose it doesn't. Do you know what happened to Haley? She is far away. Somewhere else. An infinite reality beyond you. Dead, of course. You saw to that. Yes, I did. So tell me, was it worth it? Was it satisfactory? Maybe I didn't want this. No. Maybe. Maybe not. Perhaps you yourself don't know. I do, but I don't have to tell you. So, what happens next? That is not for me to decide. I am merely a voice. That is for God to decide. Well... I look forward to meeting him. I have a few choice questions before I get thrown into hell. You sound... bitter. I am. Spirit. Creation is full of the terrible and the wonderful, the known and the infinitely unknownable, the hellish corners and the heavenly peaks, and even in death you have barely scratched the surface. I don't care. Very well. I have a message from Haley. What? Yes. Well? She says that still loves you. That is all. Okay. Of course we're going to go for a better ending than that, so yeah, 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 yeah. Thankfully it's going to be pretty simple to get back to where we were. There's also a secret number there, 11000000. Alright, so we're going to launch up the game because obviously that was just one of potential endings. Uh, okay. Go from there to here to there. Uh, is it maybe a drama queen? I could not say. Hey there, Britta. Now let's move on to back to this music machine because that was probably not the only potential possibility. I think I finished exploring all the areas. I just couldn't find a place to get inside and, and got a bad ending out of it. Alright. Well, I can load from here because I was here last time. Alright. So let's go through the hatch and end up back where we were. Thankfully, this game, just because I spent a lot of time exploring to get back where we were, won't take entirely too long. Now then, let's do what we can do. Gotta throw chairs out of the way. Pick up a crowbar. Go over here to get to this piece of wood, cardboard. Boards look new. There we go. Now we continue to follow the light this way. 
and that'll bring us back to the church, which means we can continue what we were doing. Though we're probably going to have to go back to the main world and find the abilities and the areas that we can go to. I might try going to the thorn world again, but I'm not sure if that's a dead end or not. Maybe there's something more to do there. I'm going to try it first, though. One, one. Let's see what this world is. Beautiful. <clears throat> Hug giraffe. All right, examine pixel heart. Dearest Rachel, thank you for always supporting me, even when I spend all my time obsessed with weird video game projects. I love you. P.S. I still like my original title better. I guess that's the developer's room thing. Let's use radio device. Or says that. I'm, can we return if I hop off a cliff? How do I get back to my world? There it is, found the way back. You ready to continue? Oh, the song's kind of nice. Nice chip tune. Yeah. Let's go through. So that was the secret area that we saw in the first time that we got. Alright, now to get back to the, I guess I'll call it Metal World. It's from this note here. So it's 01011. 01, so 011. 011, okay. Let's go through here and do what we can because we did it last time. What? That felt really weird. Yeah, we just read through that, so I'm just gonna basically run through this town so then go get that piece of paper. I'm actually going to save next time I get out of there, so yeah. Now, uh, so we're gonna go collect the paper and then get out of here. Then we'll have the papers that lead to other worlds, and then I can save there, and then we can continue from there if we happen to die from the thorn forest instead of having to start from that last point. Just a few things out of the way. Tick tock goes the clock, goes around and never stops. Through the tunnel we find... I was like, go away here as fast as I can. It's... Oh, we have rest the part where this happens. So over there we need to go get out of here, but we need to want to pick up the paper that shows how to access other worlds. Alright, so that should be right over here. Some debris. Oh wow, what the hell? Yep. I think it was inside this room. Inside this drawer over here. There we go, got it. Paper that'll tell us how to get to three different worlds, including the music machine. Got. Let's get out of here now. I wonder if that glowing rock with the smoke could be used for anything, or maybe it's just charcoal that makes a clingy sound, melt like everything else here. <clears throat> Let's run down the way. And here we go. Now we can get back to right what we were going with because we got another piece of paper in this. I like George. All right, so I'm gonna go over here and I'm gonna save. You have to save by exiting your game, so I'm gonna do that quickly, and then I'm gonna relaunch. All right, that is fun. Sorry, I was just quickly going through there. You guys will see the screen again in a moment. There we go. All part of the process. For those who don't know, obviously, this is the music machine because a few people just showed up. All right, so let's load our game. Now that we have a save station here, that'll be incredibly useful. All right, I'm gonna try going to the Thorn Forest again, simply because I made the save file there. 
but we'll see how useful it is. Zero one one zero one zero zero one one zero one zero. Now we can turn that into the next world. Now this is the one that hurts us. My problem is I don't know where we're supposed to be going from here. Now she's saying that the rain hurts her. Now, there might be something more here, but if we stay out too long, we will die and experience the ending we got last time. Thankfully, I have a save file, but it turns out being for the worst, and there's nothing here. There's an entrance right there. Ow. This is feeling awful, Quentin. The entrance was, of course, on the one wall I didn't get to investigate last time. There we go. So here's the steel pipe machine that we got to look at last time. Certainly is spewing with smoke. Thankfully, the smoke doesn't kill us. We don't want to investigate any of the stuff in here either. Let's try going up. Just smoldering piles of smudge is all I see. We can't jump, so it's, oh, she's. I was gonna say. I think the way out is over there. Yep, that's the way out. There could be more here, but I'll look through the windows and see if I spot anything that we haven't been through. No, I cannot. If we need to come back here, we'll come back here. I'm going to touch this and get back, though. Okay, it actually teleported me up a floor. So we're climbing the building. Let's see right in the middle of the room, though. It's moldy and rotting. And a note. Nothing here can kill me. Time or hunger or damage or will. Only the rain. The new world will be heaven, they say. Petting and poking me, cooing, retching. Time will stay still, they say. Our children will have children, will have children and prosper. Believe them? No, not now. Not after my capture. Not after the rain. They keep others somewhere. Other places, other cages. The others are strangers. I have not met them. Their names, Mary, Jessica, and Hector. One for me, one for him, they say. Now, how long have I been here? I don't know. Too long. Or not long. Or exactly as long as I deserve. Long enough, I taught them to write, damn it, to speak, to tell stories. A creature is under my building, my cage growling and whispering. Woodland teeth, it says. Your friend, it says. Listen? No, too many mistakes already. So many mistakes. Who am I? Now I know. Not Roger. Not Jesus. Not a king or a god. Not a truth crafter. I am Judas Inscuriate. It was incredibly soft and wet. I have no idea what this is. No comment, Haley. My skin hurts. Well, <laughs> touch that. Oh dear. If that's not the way out of here, though, then how do I get out? This is definitely the most obvious place. I'm gonna make sure touching this a second time, I don't think it's going to, I'm just wasting time. But, I need to make certain because I might die out there. I don't really know where I'm going, but I'm looking for something that looks like this that'll teleport me back to the church then. Well, time to investigate the strange and the odd. Let's hope that we can go through the next area without killing ourselves this time. Any sort of building to enter into. It's not a building that we've already been in. I think we we'll have to head towards the building that we've already been in. So I'd rather not die. There it is. 
Uh, please, Quentin, please. It hurts. There I go. 